Hey guys, I'm Nadia and today we're going to check out the alpaca loom here in Pol. The biggest confusion that we get is between llamas and alpacas. Mm -hmm. So in front of us, we have an alpaca on your right hand side, and we have two llamas over here. Okay. So just be careful, they can spit and they careful, will spit. Josh. So just be careful <laughs> trying to touch them too much. Um, they are friendly, but if they, if they say no, or the rubber bone. So as you can see, they're a lot taller than the alpacas that are next to them. They also have longer toes, so if you look at their toes, they have almost like dinosaur looking feet. <laughs> and they have longer and more banana shaped ears, so when their ears are up, it falls inwards like that. And they also don't have wool, so they actually almost have like fuzzy hair. Um, so you can't spit it into yarn and they don't create it fast enough to shear them every year. So we shear them once every three years just to get a lot of that hair off of them. Um, but it doesn't grow at a fast rate at all. <laughs> so here we have Obelix and we have Asterix over there. <laughs> going to go do an alpaca tour and we're going down to the barns where we're going to see the little babies and the moms and um, I think there's a baby that's basically a day old that we can go check out and basically on the tour they just they tell you more about the animals and how they actually use the fur and make their products it's really awesome guys Just like sheep, they have no top teeth. So this llama baby was literally born yesterday. It's only a day old. Are they fighting over the food? <laughs> Thanks for watching my video guys and remember to like, share and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!